Good morning, Vlogmas day. What day is it? Nine? Hi. Oh no. My sweatpants are literally two completely different colors. Um, yeah, good morning, Vlogmas day nine. I need to go change my set color because this is not right. But I'm getting my car detailed this morning. Thank you guys so much for replying to my stories. If you live in the Boston area and helping me find a good place to get my car detailed, they're literally coming to my house to do it. Um, so I'm so excited because then I don't need to leave and they're coming here, which is great. Bye, good morning. <laughs> Doing a before and after of my car. Here's a before. I can't believe I'm even, I'm even showing you guys how oh, gross. My car is from the summer and it's like December now. And there's like all these white marks all over it, which I have no idea what those are from. Probably like, I don't even know. I don't even sit in the back of my car, so it's disgusting. I like cannot wait until it's all clean. So let's see how it goes. So gross, literally so much sand. I'm in like my hair that falls everywhere. So excited to see how it looks after. There's a police officer next to me. Cool. Bye. Anyway, um, I'm gonna put my hood on so I don't look so weird. Hi. 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 You haven't seen me since my workout. 
Um, also, and I was gonna do a little uh, before and after of my car, right? The people detailing my car never showed up. Literally never showed up. They texted me like probably an hour ago. Not an hour, yeah, an hour ago or so, like two hours ago, which they were supposed to come at 10 a.m. They texted me at like four, three, three or four, whatever. And they were like, hi, like, can we come tomorrow morning? Like, no, you, I literally had an appointment for 10 a.m. for you guys to come to my apartment and like detail my car. And then they just didn't show up. And then text me was like, can I show up at whenever time? I was like, no, I'm not even gonna be here. So. Like, I didn't get my car detailed. I'm gonna have to find a new place, like another place in Boston to get it detailed. I don't, like, I mean, this one place my friend recommended and they were like, oh, they come to you, like, it'll be so easy. So I did that, but I never really knew people came to you. I don't really care. Like, I will drop my car off somewhere. I just need to get it cleaned. Like, she's just never been cleaned, so, like. But I'm going to Sephora right now, currently. I have some stuff I really want to get to try out. Some new makeup. I also really, really, really need to get a winter foundation. Because I haven't done that yet. Gotten a winter foundation. It's literally December. I've just been using my summer foundation. And I realized um, it does not match. I mean, it matches when I self-tan. Which it makes no sense for me to like go and get a new foundation today but I also need to film tonight I have a lot of filming to do so I have to get like a new SD card because mine is literally on like holding on by a string holding on by a literal thread let me tell you like my SD card is so broken so I need to do that I don't even know why I'm telling you guys all this stuff because I need to stop talking and showing you guys more of my vlogs so let's bye Sephora didn't have what I really wanted um, a lot of this stuff was out so I got different things a few different things just to like try out I don't even know what I got I completely forget what I got but we're gonna see okay so for the foundation I got um, the one that I wanted was the one that I normally use the Giorgio Armani 5.5 but I well not 5.5 Giorgio Armani luminous silk foundation that's the one that I wanted but they didn't have that at all like they didn't carry Giorgio Armani at that store which it's my favorite foundation so like that's the only one I really wear but the girl was like why don't you try out a different one because I just needed one that was my shade for the video that I'm filming today because my foundation, I don't have any self tanner on, like it would have been crazy looking. So I got the Airbrush Flawless Foundation by Charlotte Tilbury. Um, I guess it's kind of the same as the Giorgio Armani. Giorgio Armani one, it's still pretty full coverage and covers everything. That's exactly what I wanted. The flaw, what is it? The, not the Airbrush Finish, the Airbrush finish but i think it's a flawless filter by charlotte tilbury that one is a lighter coverage foundation and so we tried that one on too but i wanted a uh, more full coverage because yeah i like more lighter stuff in the summertime and fuller in the winter i feel like that's like a normal thing for people to like and then i was on my way out in the checkout line and i saw this little pencil it's the sephora mini eye pencil um this is white just like a pure white eye pencil i use the patrick ta cream pencil like the cream gel eyeliner cream pencil um but i find that it i don't know it's cream it looks beautiful on i just wanted to try out white for some reason i just feel like it would look so cool and also 
I don't, I feel like since the other one's like a, almost like a gel cream consistency, I wonder if this is a pencil. I don't know. I'm assuming it's a pen pencil so that it's going to be like a different application and like kind of look different and be a little bit more. Yeah. So this is literally like a colored pencil. So I feel like this is going to be a bit more, I mean, I don't even know how it's going to apply now that it's not cream. So we'll see. We're trying it out, you know? Oh, and by the way, I got this in 5.5 neutral. Um, hopefully that's a good color. And then I also got the Patrick Ta Clear Brow Freeze. It was the last one left, and I feel like I've seen this all over TikTok, so I was like, might as well try it out since it's literally the last one. Um, so yeah, I got this to try it out. I am a holy grail, swear by the Benefit Brow setter 24 hour brow setter and i've never tried anything else but that brow setter for the last like five years so we're gonna see how this brow freeze works oh okay it's a really funny box you literally can't even see it, it looks empty so so excited to try this out and then oh and then cvs i got makeup <laughs> you guys makeup remover wipes are bad for your skin i know i get it um i got like the mini single makeup remover wipes just because i am visiting ella at school this weekend actually literally tomorrow so i feel like this will be nice to have for like just easy taking off my makeup i know it's so bad for your skin but like i'm not bringing rags and my like makeup melting stuff to her go co her college for the weekend like not doing that so and then i got a little mini toothpaste to bring because i'm out of my travel toothpaste i got a new sd card for you guys because mine is broken and we cannot have a broken sd card during a vlogmas i've been like hoping and praying every single time i go to upload a video that it doesn't break so it's time for a new one um normally i have like 15 on deck but half of them like broke so i haven't had any in a while literally like the worst at youtube and stuff actually no what am i saying i'm not the worst i just like these are the last things that i think about getting when you're a youtuber you'd understand like it's literally the last thing i mean maybe it's just me but i don't know then i also got some a pack of razors um the razor that I normally use. It is the Hydro Silk, but it's like the detachable, um, the detachable little heads. But this one's the non-detachable heads. I don't know. All I know is I just didn't feel like pressing the button and waiting for someone to come over to get the detachable heads out of the case. So I just got these. They're the same. I don't know any they're just the only difference is you have to like throw them away after so they're disposable i guess and these ones have covers so this is good for when i travel i don't know why i just don't buy these more also i do have laser but my hair does grow back like once a week but it barely even grows back it's like peach fuzz literally don't know and then i got another one of these um eyelash curlers because my eyelash curler that I have, I don't know what brand I got. I literally got like a random brand from Target, I think. And it's really small. And I wasn't even like meaning, like I wasn't at, like I wasn't looking to get one of these today. But then I saw this one and it looks bigger than the one that I have. And so I'm hoping that this fits my eyebrows a bit. My eyebrows? Excuse me? I'm hoping this one fits my eyelashes a bit more. Um, I'm new to curling my eyelashes and I've been obsessed with it. So this is the Revlon one. I don't know if it's good or what at all. Um, I've heard the Dior one is better, but we don't have time for that because I'm a beginner, so I don't know what is good. So we're going to try out the Revlon one. Holy shit. What if it like cut off my fucking eyelashes? Oh my god, that horrifying whatever so yeah thanks for watching my haul is that all yeah that's all 
about to film a really exciting video. I have my little skim set on. I'm obsessed with this little PJ set. It's one of my favorites ever, but I'm so excited to do this video and I can't wait to show it to you guys and everything. So I'm gonna go do that. I'm getting all my stuff prepared to bring it into Maggie's bathroom to film in there because the lighting in there is way better than my yellow bathroom. It's funny because I have the yellow bathroom in the gray room. Maggie has the gray bathroom in the yellow room. So doesn't make sense, but we work with it. And I'm gonna go take over her bathroom right now. So see you there. Hi, I finished my video. Um, now I'm editing. And I'm enjoying some <laughs> chocolate covered strawberries. Frozen chocolate covered strawberries from Trader Joe's. Um, there's literally one, two, three, four, five left. So I'm gonna do this and edit. It's nine and I really wanna go to bed early. So I'm gonna try to get this done pretty early. Um, this might be the end of the video. So I'm gonna end off today's video and start editing it. But yeah, I love you guys, and I'll see you guys in my next video tomorrow. Bye. <laughs>